Well, hey. <laughs> Sorry, I was, <laughs> I've just been watching like so lots of stand up and I can't I can't get some of the jokes out of my head. Hello everyone and welcome to the Halloween special. Uh to celebrate the day of Halloween, which I'm not too fussed about. I'm more of a Halloween 364 rather than the 365th day. But I do respect those who put in extra effort for the Halloween day. I look like this all the time. So, there's not really much else I can do. My tooth paint is kind of chipped because I'm using, I'm scraping the bottle to get this on, so it's not the best quality stuff anymore. And I can't go get more because the store that I get it from is jam packed with normies buying Halloween costumes! Appropriating my culture! I don't really think, I don't really think that. So, usually, whenever I show you guys like a, a product or something, it's either gifted or it's a sponsored thing, but th this is, I bought this. I bought this on my own because someone actually suggested that I do this on the Discord. I don't need to be secretive about it, the thumbnail and the title were indication enough as to what the contents of this video is going to be. Someone suggested that I get Vanta Black and see what I can do with it, but apparently some pretentious douchebag called Anish Kapoor has claimed exclusivity on Vanta Black. You cannot actually get it. It is not available to the public. But thankfully, there have been other companies and other artists out there who have tried to replicate the blackest black and create it in a format that is not only available to the general public, but is also affordable and is also a usable medium because Vanta Black, not really that applicable to a lot of things from what I'm aware, because it's not actually paint. It's like a fabric. I, th I think it's something like that. Sharing information on something I'm not particularly educated on. Welcome to YouTube. <laughs> so I was very disappointed to discover that I can, in fact, not get hold of the very famous, ubiquitous Vanta Black. Because everyone knows what Vanta Black is. So I decided to go on the hunt for an alternative. And yes, there was, in fact, an alternative. It was called Black 2.0. And I was like, well, Black 2.0 sounds super cool. But then I delved further into the internet and found out that the same company did make a Black 3.0. This is the gothest thing. Ever. This is so great. <laughs> so glad this is real. <laughs> so yes, inside of this little stylish cardboard tube is a product called Black 3.0, and I believe oh, it is an acrylic paint, which can be used much like any other acrylic paint. I believe it's an acrylic paint. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to read some of the uh, the directions and the instructions that we have on the bottle. Also some things that you can find online and not in this bottle. And then I'm gonna do the most goth slash Halloween thing ever and paint a f***ing pumpkin with the blackest black available to the general public. So allow me to read the descriptions, the do's, the don'ts, and also any additional information on the side of this bottle. There's also a link in the description. If you want, this is not sponsored. I This is not an ad. This is not gifted. This was not suggested to me by the brand. This was someone on the Discord said, hey, hey Jake, play with this, and I did, and then I bought it, because it's cheap and affordable. Super flat, super matte, ultra pigmented acrylic paint. It is acrylic paint. Do not eat it, drink it, or get it in your eyes, tattoo, or paint your body, which I was very disappointed to discover, because I originally wanted to paint myself with this, but it says don't do that. But I might do it anyway. <laughs> also, do not apply to hot surfaces. Do shake well before use, keep out of reach of kids and animals, apply two thin coats on shiny surfaces, allow to dry between layers, thin with up to 40% water to spray. Share with the world, hashtag culture hustle. Also in the description, if you, f if you feel unwell, call a doctor and take this bottle with you, wash brushes with water, more info at culturehustle.com. It's in the description, you can, you can get this for yourself, it's fine. It's also non-toxic and it conforms to ASTM. So yes, Black 3.0, officially the blackest black available on the consumer market. Vanta Black may or may not be actually black, or I, I'm pretty sure it is, but you can't get it. <laughs> it's not available, only this is. So this is officially the blackest black in the world available to people, as far as I'm aware. I did a little bit of research, and by that I mean I clicked the top result. <laughs> now another bit of information that is available on the website and not on that bottle is that it takes about 20 hours for the black to attain full blackness. So I actually already have the pumpkin here, it has been about 14 hours since I painted it, so it's near maximum blackness. So I'm going to show you what the pumpkin looks like in just a second, but before that, here is a time lapse of me... Uh, right, oh, I just, I need to explain what happened. <laughs> so, I, I I got Kaya a Dremel uh, at some point this year, 
which is kind of like, it's like a power tool, it's like a power drill with a little bit, and you can change the bits to do certain things, like sanding and a little saw. But she hasn't used it yet, so I thought I'd use it to cut this pumpkin, because cutting a pumpkin is a pain in the ass, so I thought maybe with this power tool, it, it would be easier. Turns out, not easier at all, nearly died. Uh, it's actually on the camera. <laughs> <laughs> so, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna, in editing, I'm gonna try and find it, because it's in a very large amount of footage. I'm gonna try and find the moment where I didn't put the drill bit on correctly, so it was not as tight as it should have been. And it's this little saw blade. And as I was sawing away at the pumpkin when I first started, it started to like wobble a bit. And because I wasn't entirely sure how to switch it off, because I knew how to switch it off, because I wasn't familiar with this tool, I, I put it all the way to the left, which is max power. Uh, by accident. So the drill bit's wibbling away, I'm trying to switch it off, but instead I go full power, so what do you think happened next? The drill bit came flying off, smacked off the wall, and then landed right next to me. It could have been so much worse, because that thing came off the drill bit so fast, it actually bent when it hit the wall. I could have really hurt myself. So then I went back to the knife, and then I tried to draw on the face with like the, the sander tool, to see if that would be cool but it, it wasn't cool, so I ended up just like drawing the entire face with the sander and then getting a knife and like cutting it anyway. It's it's really stupid, and I thought I should mention it, because otherwise all the comments are gonna be like, why did he do- why did he- why did he do it like that? Like, what is he doing? So without further ado, here is the time lapse of me carving and gutting the pumpkin, not in that order, and then subsequently painting the pumpkin. And when we come back, I will show you what it looks like now. And here we go! And welcome back! So I'm about to show you the pumpkin now as, as it looks about 14 hours after I initially painted it. And uh... It looks pretty good! I mean, I'm, I am in front of like a really bright photo light. Like, I mean like really bright. But even still, it is like black as hell. It's really, really dark. Actually, let me try and compensate for the lighting. So that's about as dark as it is in here. You see how black that is? It's like... Super super dark. How cool is that? I painted a Halloween pumpkin with the world's blackest black. Beat that! All right, I'm gonna put this back up to what it was. There we go. So yes, there we have it. What do you guys? What do you guys think? If there actually is a way to get hold of Vanta Black, or if there is actually a blacker black out there, I want you guys to leave a comment and let me know because I want to actually play with it and have fun with it and break the rules with it. <laughs> <laughs> do things with it I should not be doing. Real quick, I will be doing a members only live stream tomorrow at 10. It, it will be listed, so you won't have to worry about the time. But I'm doing a live stream tomorrow, UK time, 10 o'clock, which is for members only. I think everyone can watch it, but only members can actually comment. So if you want to comment on that and you want to be a part of that stream, then click the little join button down below, support the channel directly, and also you can talk to me through the entirety of me playing Silent Hill. Three. We've played two, 
We just finished the first one, so now I'm gonna play my favorite one, which is Silent Hill 3, because Heather is a badass. Man, I had so much fun butchering this pumpkin and then painting it and stuff. It was like, it was, it was like a little arts and craft project. I felt like I was back in school or something. Okay, everyone, I had a great day today because I made it a great day. I hope you have a great Halloween, and hopefully I will see you guys in the comment section of my live stream tomorrow evening on Halloween. If not, I will see you on Friday as usual. Okay, goodbye everyone. Thank you.